Ni hao. Hello, China. My name is Van Darkholm. As you know, I'm a dungeon master. I am here with my friends on Twitch. Um, we are here to do Chinese Lords of the Locker Room reenactment review. Okay? This is like um, in America, we have a man called James Lipton. And he does inside the actor's studio. It's serious acting um, around here. Since James Lipton passed away, so I am here <laughs> taking his place for inside the studios. And uh, let's shall we shall we look at some. Um, you know, a Chinese video reenactment. But first, I want to show you the script, all right? This is a classic. Everybody, go get your uh, pencil and paper and write down the script, okay? Here's the script. Wow! So, um, Lords of the Locker Room. And uh, Mark Wolf said, hey, buddy, I think you got the wrong door. The leather cloth is two block down. And I, Van Sama, said, fuck you. Mark said, oh, fuck you, leather man. Maybe you and I should set it right here on the ring if you think you're so tough. I said, oh, yeah, I'll kick your ass. Mark says, ha, yeah, right, man. Let's go. Why don't you get out of that leather stuff? I'll strip down off this well, and we'll settle it right here in the ring. What do you say? I say, yeah, no problem, buddy. Mark said, you got it. Get out of that uh, jabroni outfit. I said, smart ass. Mark said, I'll show you who the boss of this gym. Let's go! So that is the script. Please, did you have a chance to copy it? Just pause the video and copy it. And um, let's look at first the Russian, okay? Just a short, just a short clip. This clip's only like one minute long. So you can see, you know, there's dialogue, there's tension, there's costume, um, and so we're going to look at three um, Chinese reenactment, and I also going to announce that there's going to be a contest in China for the best Lords of the Locker Room reenactment. You will win a prize. Maybe Van Sama t-shirt and pillow. Um, it would, I will, it will be more details in the description below the video, okay? There's going to be a prize for the contest. I will pick the best one and the most hilarious, the most funny. I guess maybe the best one is the most funny, but there's two categories. And um, let's go. Let's see. Let's look at the first one, shall we? Maybe you have to this right here in the ring. Yeah. If you think it's that child. Yes. Huh. Like a baby. Let's go. 
Why don't you get out of the little stuff? I will sit down after this, I will set you right here in the ring. What you say? Yeah, no problem. You got it. Get the letter to run your feet. Yeah, smart ass. Change balls of this gym. Come on, let's go. Yeah. <coughs> let's go. <boy. coughs> <Pretty> quick. <coughs> Okay, not bad. Not not bad at all. Uh, Chad, I I kind of like that. I, I feel. <laughs> okay, let's uh let's break it down. Okay. Let's break it down. Okay, um, it's, it's a dorm room. I think it's a dorm room. I like, I like the, um, the, off, the costume, it's nice. The little mask is kind of cool. So far, I, I'm digging it. Hey buddy, hey buddy. I say we go to the door, the little cuts, two cuts, that's that. Fuck you. Oh, fuck you, little man. man. Maybe you asked the teacher here in the ring. Yeah. If you think it's a chance. Okay, so. <laughs> you stuck with the script, it's pretty good to a point. And then after that, I, I, I can't distinguish between the English and the Chinese. Um, so maybe this will help. Take, take your time. Um, don't rush it, okay? Because uh, you, when you want to talk too fast, we're, we're not going to understand you. So, you know, I know you want to get it over with so you can just dry hump your buddy. But uh, you still got to do the work. You got to still have to say your lines. And take your time to do your, you know, your art. The dry hump will come soon enough. Like a baby. Let's go. Why don't you get out of the little stuff? I will sit down after this. I will set you right here in the ring. What you say? Yeah, no problem. You got it. Get the letter to run your feet. Yeah, smart ass. Change balls of this gym. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Yeah, yeah. Okay, um. First of all, I like my character in here. He he slowed it down. He's smart ass. Yeah. You know, he's taking his time. The Mark Wolf character is like, um, needs a little work. That's what I'm, I'm going to be nice and say. It needs a little work. And also, uh, show some skin, boys. What's with the t-shirt? Come on, show some skin. And then if you decide to put a t-shirt on, you got a fucking tag bag here sticking out. Uh, this is never good on, on video. It's just not good, okay? Tuck it in. Let's <laughs> go. Okay, um... I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna critique too much on the fighting. It seems like it's, uh, you guys are just enjoying it way too much. I'm not seeing any like struggling at all. It's like, ah. <laughs> um, so I, right now, the first Maybe video, the hold on. So let me let me get them both in. What did he say? I didn't hear what he said. <laughs> that guy right there with the white mask, I can only understand him like maybe 25%. Um, so I will give it because they did make an attempt with the uh, the script. They stuck with the with the classic 
script. So I'll give it three jabroni, three jabronis out of five. You got three out of five, okay? Um, thank you so much. But I, I suggest you guys try it again. Take your shirts off. Slow down the dialogues. And um, three out of five. Let's go to the next one, shall we? We got two more. These are only like a, a minute long, so it's not that bad. Lords of the Locker Room reenactment. China style, number two, number two. Interessante is muy interessante. There's our pluses and minuses. As with everything in life, boys and girls. Um, I don't know where to begin. I don't know. <laughs> okay, first of all, um, the gym. Plus, big plus for the gym, all right? But then, um, I think, I'm not going to blame it on... Hey, Profaki, thanks for the five months. I'm not gonna blame it on the actor. I think it's the director who, uh, who's at fault here because um, it's like they're like 30 feet apart. And you know, I mean, it's, uh, it's a little bit a long stretch, all right? Because they're shouting each other across the room, like way across the room. Move in a little closer. This is what I'm talking about. Okay, and then <laughs> it's just like right away, fuck you, and then let, let's go at it. Let's go fucking at it, okay? Come on. Where is the meat? The meat is in the dialogue. You gotta do, you gotta learn your lines, people. If you wanna be a performance artist, you gotta take time and practice. And also, too, the director, 
We want close up of these guys when they say their lines. It's just not stand back here and just go ah, 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 one take. No. You, the director, you gotta go wide shot. Are you gonna say your line? I'm gonna move my camera up. Get a close up of the guy's face. The other guy gonna say, hold on. Say the other line. And then you edit it together. Just don't stand there, but just go on like this and then just go up. Come on! They take their shirts off. That's a real wrestling match. Yes. But then, I'm not going to be picky, but I have to be. Because um, I want you guys to be world class. I can't even tell who's Van Sama. Oh, Van Sama um, character is the one in the, uh, the funky sweatpants. Um, the, the green dots sweatpants. Where's your jabroni outfit? Come on! You can get stuff like uh, belts. The Russian use belts for their harnesses. Be creative. You know, a little collar. Maybe um, borrow it from your dog for five minutes to do a scene. Say, hey puppy, can I borrow it from you? Borrow the collar or, um, you know, make an attempt. The jabroni outfit is very important. And the lines is very important. It's like, huh, 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 fuck you. And then you're fighting. Okay, the fighting is, is good. The fighting is like, um, it's like a cherry on top of an ice cream. It's, it's something extra. The whole scene, it's about the talking, the dirty, you know, the mean talking between the two guys, the, the look. They give each other the attitude, the tension. Um, that is what about. And the wrestling, it's just something extra on top. And you guys flip it in reverse. You guys just like, we're just going to say fuck you and we're just going to go at it. <laughs> um, and that's not what the scene is all about. We have to like just do the work. Okay? Okay, um, you pull down the sweatpants and he's wearing another sweatpants underneath that. <laughs> well, first of all, I have to say, um, great physique guy, very sexy, very sexy, all right? But, um, you know, would it kill you to wear like shorts maybe? It's just strange that you're pulling down long pants and the other dude has long pants underneath it. Um, <laughs> it's just, it's just strange. <laughs> Well, 
I gotta give you guys some credit for um, I gotta give you guys some credits for the um, the wrestling moves. I like a couple of those moves you you made. That's really cool. I recognize those. Very good. But um, it's the. <laughs> Uh, we can cut that down a little bit. So this one is it's a tough one because you got the gym there. You guys in great shape. You took your shirts off, but you didn't do the dialogue. So you know, as much as I love it, I'm still gonna have to give you guys three. Three out of five jabronis, okay? If you did a, the dialogue, I would have given you four jabronis. And then if you were to put like some kind of jabroni outfit on, that's where you get the five jabronis. But, um, you know, back to the drawing board, guy. Let's get back to the studio and study your lines and let's make it happen. I know you guys can do it. But I know this is the first time, it's hard. <laughs> At least you guys did some wrestling move, right? It's not dry humping like the first one. Um, <laughs> and last one of the day, okay? We're gonna go to the last one of the day. What's <laughs> Fuck you. Ah. Ah 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 Where do I even begin? Um, okay, we're back to the dorm room. Okay, there's nothing wrong with the dorm room. Um, it's kind of cool because it kind of give me, you know, like the, the glints into the, uh, the Chinese, um, you know, day-to-day -day life. Kind of interesting. I kind of like seeing people, you know, in Russia, they, they like to wrestle in their babushka, um, living room with the, with the wood cabinet and the chinas in the cabinets. Um, the Russian loves to do that. But then here we get to see, you know, the dorm room, which is cool. And again, there, okay, let me see, let me, let me hear what the guy said in the beginning because I didn't catch it at all. What? <laughs> okay, this you can't speak Chinese. It has to be <laughs> because it's like he said something in Chinese, I think, and then the other guy just go fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Okay, um, <laughs> the, 
We have to take the, it's only one minute. There's only like six lines, people. You can memorize that. If you go on to school, you, you can have time to memorize six lines, all right? Um, so there's no dialogue. It's just uh, something in Chinese and then it just fuck you, okay? But I gotta give the one, the, uh, I don't know who's who. That's hard to tell. Which one is my character? Chat, can you help me out? Which one do you think is my character? <laughs> um, <laughs> the one that's banging is my character? Yours is in the back. Okay, so you guys think, okay. The one, that one I gotta give a little bit of a credit because he looked like he's just like, the acting is really good, okay? He's like, Okay. <laughs> I like that. I like that. That's um, <laughs> one out of five. <laughs> Chris has evolved. You are so mean. Um, I kind of like that. Okay. So far, I like the intensity. Um, again, there's no attempt to look like me or Mark Wolf. The shirt, the shirts are on. There's no jabroni outfit. You got to work on that. And it just, just smacking the shit out of each other. This is basically, that's what it's about. <laughs> <laughs> okay, there's a lot of dry humping going on in this one. Um, can I get a replay of that? <laughs> you saw it twice. I think twice is enough. And uh, the Mark Wolf character, there's no giggling in acting, all right? Uh, just remember that. He's fucking giggling the whole time. Look at that giggling. This is serious business, okay? You're doing, um, you're doing a masterpiece and you gotta commit 100% to the character. You gotta live the character. And I felt like my character, um, the guy who's doing it is doing a pretty good job. But the Mark Wolf character is giggling the whole entire time. they're just horsing around okay so uh, just for that you're gonna get two two out of five jabroni yes you're gonna start crying right now go ahead and cry I know you're crying right now but you were giggling earlier so maybe we should do more homework You only got yourself to blame for it. Put the work in. You only got yourself to blame. <laughs> Actually, I'm just joking. Um, that was a lot of fun. That was Lords of the Locker Room reenactment from China. And I'm repeating again, um, very good first three attempt, but I think we need a lot of work to do. So um, let's get to work. You can do it and there's a prize. There's gonna be a contest, redo it and there's gonna be a huge contest coming, okay? Very good, very good, okay.